Ward. We are starting tonight tracking continued breaking news right now. Spokane police still on the scene of a shooting at this hour in downtown Spokane. The intersection of Howard and Riverside has been closed since noon. Police say they shot a man who they say threatened people with a knife. That's where we find Krem 2 Shannon Mowdy, who just finished talking with the Spokane police chief. Shannon? Well, I'm here at Howard and Riverside. We are right by the Giza Credit Union, but I want to direct your attention a little ways past that down Howard. You can see that this is still an active scene where they are investigating. This is the area where Spokane police shot one man this afternoon. And in the last couple of hours, I did speak with interim police chief Justin Lundgren, who provided some preliminary info. So what we know right now is that three Spokane police officers tried tasing this suspect first before two officers shot him. We know that man was on some type of parole. Chief Lundgren says just after noon, the suspect called his Department of Corrections supervising officer to report he was suicidal, that he was walking around downtown and police say he was armed with a knife and threatened at least two people. He held the knife up towards one individual's throat and then he also uh, displayed the knife and backed another individual down the block. The SEER team is now taking over the investigation. That's a lot of the activity that we are still seeing between Riverside and Main Street on Howard. Chief Lundgren says at last check, the man was in surgery. We don't have an update on his medical condition at this point, but this area is still completely blocked off to traffic and pedestrians. We have police still um, directing people away from walking through the area. These closures run from Maine to Riverside on Howard. Riverside is shut down between Wall and Stevens. At this point, we don't have any estimate on when this area could reopen. Shannon Mowdy, Crumb 2 News.